I want to thank everybody for coming this morning. My name is John D'Angelo. I'm the manager of the Arts and Cultural Service Division for the City of Wichita. I certainly glad to see everybody here today. Um, this is part of an input process about picking some new chairs for our concert hall, which is directly behind me to my left. Um, and it's an important process for us because these chairs have been in need of replacement. And so this is going to be an exciting time. I'm happy to also recognize Mayor Carl Brewer and Council Member Levanta Williams uh, here today. And I'm going to start this off by letting the mayor make a few comments uh, about this important process to allow the public to have input on our chairs. Well, good morning, everyone. To start off with, uh, there's no doubt there must be some problems with those chairs for that many of you to be here to make a decision on some new ones today. I want to thank you for coming to Century 2 today to have a seat. We're here to try out and to vote for our favorite sample chair that you see over here. That feedback will be used to, to select a chair style for the new seats in Concert Hall. So the goal today is simply, is simple. Take a seat, pick a chair. Of course, leave it there and don't stay long. And I want to see as many people in our community be today between the hours, between from the time we finish here at 10 o'clock until also at 7 p.m. Uh, to come in and to cast their votes. So encourage all of your friends and your relatives or individuals that belong to your associations to please come and uh, take an opportunity to vote. We want to make sure that we get the right one. This way we make sure that everyone is comfortable when they come here to watch the world-class performances at Concert Hall. Taking a seat today represents one more step forward in the journey to revitalize downtown. We're excited about recent successes downtown. Let's maintain that momentum here at Century 2 as we pick out the new chairs. Hold on, you can't get to the chairs yet. I see this, this anxiety here. We have to let John D'Angelo explain more details about what's going to be going on. Thank you, Mayor. <clears throat> what we want to do is invite the residents of Wichita to come down and vote for the chairs. Um, over this past year, there's over 195,000 tickets sold and people sitting in these chairs, so your input is uh, definitely needed for us to make sure we make the right decision. Um, all, all residents have to do is come to Century 2 between the connecting lobby um, between 10 and 7, between now and next Wednesday, Tuesday, I'm looking back there at my script writer here, um, to, to vote. And the voting ballot box is right there for them to vote on which chairs. We sent out proposals to about 41 different vendors. We received uh, three chairs with samples were required. We have an internal staff committee that will be making the decision. Uh, this is how the city process operates on all projects of this kind. So the actual chair that gets selected is reviewed by experts as well as individual input that we're getting here to make the best selection possible. There are 2,200 chairs that are currently in Concert Hall. The intent is to replace those and not to decrease the size of the hall, but to maintain the seating and the seating configuration that we currently have. The sample chairs are just one part of uh, additional uh, projects that we have here at Century 2, which include in Concert Hall, the painting of the hall, the new carpet in the hall. So all these improvements will be done in a small amount of time starting in August of this year and being completed by October. I'm looking at a person who I have come to admire for his work ethic and what he's doing, and I'm going to recognize him just to embarrass him. Mr. Jim Bishop with our Public Works Department, he is instrumental in orchestrating this, um, and I know that the symphony who's sitting next to him understands the conductor's role. That's what we're looking to Mr. Jim Bishop to, to be the conductor of uh, all the different contractors that have to be involved just to make Concert Hall happen in that amount of time. We're also excited to recognize Wichita Symphony, Music Theater of Wichita, and certainly our other tenant, the Grand Opera. 
uh, upstairs as part of this process because we want their input as well and have been working with them. Uh, the good news is the symphony will open next year to the new chairs and the new auditorium look. Um, so as soon as music theater's season is closed this year, we will get in there, fix the place up, and then hopefully open up for the uh, symphony to perform right after that. So that's our intent. Um, this is part of about a $1.5 million renovation just in concert hall. There is also uh, renovations that will be occurring in expo hall, convention hall, uh, as part of the $22 million that the city council just recently approved. These improvements include some, some more cosmetic, such as caulking. They include the window system. So there's a lot of different projects that are going to be going on around here um, that you're going to see happen and make Century 2 look and freshen it up a little bit for our patrons because we feel it's a viable asset to this community, certainly for what it's contributed over the last 40 years it's been here. So this is an exciting time for us. Um, I don't want to go much longer than that. What I would like to do is invite the mayor and council member Williams to go over and have a seat as he explained and pick a seat. And we'd like for all of you to do the same. The ballot box is at the end. So pick your chair. And again, I want to thank everybody for coming.